Hi, John Clements, the manager of horticulture here at San Diego Botanic Garden, and I'm in Palm Canyon. Have you been to Palm Canyon? You need to be in Palm Canyon, especially these summer days, because it's cool and it's refreshing, and you feel like you're in the tropics, but there's always that cool Encinitas breeze. And I am with one of my favorite palms. Do I say all my plants are my favorite? They are my favorites, but this is so cool. This is Brahea edulis. Some people say Brahea, I say Brahea, Brahea edulis. And this is commonly known as the Guadalupe fan palm. And this is a very special plant to me. I grew up being a deckhand on the Qualifier 105 and the Royal Polaris with Bill Poole and Bruce Barnes. And Guadalupe Island was not fished for a long, long time. Nobody really even thought about it. And when we discovered Guadalupe Island, well, we didn't discover it, but wow, fishing there was epic. I've never seen fishing like that. And this palm is from that island. It's offshore of Baja. And you also, in that name, edulis, you see that that refers to being edible. Well, what part of this palm would be edible? The fruit is, and it's fabulous. It's a black droop, sort of a date, and you can eat them and they're really delicious. And this is a palm that I don't know why it doesn't get planted more widely because it is very well behaved. Rather than the Mexican fan palm, this tops off at about 25 feet. There are no spines and for a palm lover, this is the best part. It's self-cleaning. When the fronds get old, they just drop off and you get this beautiful, clean trunk. So if you want a palm in your landscape, I can't recommend a palm more than this one. This is Brahea edulis at Palm Canyon.